Hi, I'm Terry Moore from MCCI. Today I'm going to be talking about the MCCI USB Connection Exerciser, which I hold in my hand. The Connection Exerciser is a test tool and a development tool that helps you in, in, in automating connection and disconnection of USB devices. So you don't have to do it by hand. Um, looking at this panel, you can see it's got an a input uh, connection for your USB device. It's got an output connection that goes to your uh, USB uh, victim host. It's got a number of push buttons, which you can use for doing manual testing. It's got on the back a power connection and a USB connection, which can also provide power. And over this USB connection, you can control the connection exerciser from a test control computer. So you can automate all kinds of interesting tests. So let's use it in manual mode first, so I, you can get a feeling for what it can do. I have here a Western Digital USB 3.0 um, uh, hard drive. And we have here a victim computer. This is running Windows 8.1. A USB 3 cable. And so this is what things look like when you're ready to start testing. Now, you'll notice that nothing has happened yet. The USB connection exerciser does require power. And as I said before, it gets it from the back panel. We'll be using the test computer in a second, so I'll just hook it to the test computer to get power for now. And you can see a light came on. It says super speed attach. And the uh, Windows 8.1 computer popped up a window that shows the root drive of the, the root directory of the drive. Now I can push a button, disconnect, and everything's disconnected. Now already this is very useful because these USB 3 cables are very stiff. Computers are very light these days. It's very easy for me when I'm plugging this in to move the computer off the edge of the table or something. It's it's kind of kind of embarrassing. So I find in development just this feature is extraordinarily helpful. Um, but another thing that's nice is that instead of connecting your super speed device in USB 3 mode, you can connect your device in, in USB 2 mode. So in this case, what's happened is that the, the drive has now been connected. It's enumerated in US, as a USB 2 device. So it's running more slowly, but now you can test all the data paths for USB 2. Um, Often what you want to do is do a stress test on your host computer to make sure that it can enumerate and, and uh, uh, recognize and disconnect the device over and over again. So we have a button that says uh, automatic mode. So when you push that button, the connection exerciser goes back and forth. And if you listen, Windows is enumerating and, and disconnecting. Now, you can also see that this is going kind of fast. Windows isn't quite popping up the, the, uh, the, the disk uh, window to show you the root directory. That's a good test, but it may not be what you want. You may want to actually have the system wait a little bit longer, uh, maybe seven seconds to let Windows completely enumerate the drive, um, and then disconnect for a little bit longer so that everything's completely uh, cleaned up on Windows afterwards. So for that, we use a test control computer, which is what I'm going to show you next. This is our test control computer. It's running Windows 7. Uh, it doesn't have to be running Windows 7. We can support Linux or Mac OS. The USB connection exerciser operates as a HID, or HID class device. So it's uh, supported by any operating system. Uh, HID class is, is universally supported. There's easy ways to get to HID devices from uh, an application. We supply a test application that, that will operate uh, all the features of the connection exerciser. So let's suppose that what we want to do is connect the, the mass storage device uh, for seven seconds, disconnect it for four seconds, switch speeds, connect, disconnect, switch back, connect, disconnect, and just do that forever. Well, to do that, we can write a script. And we provide a number of scripts along with 
the, the uh, connection exerciser software distribution, one of them does exactly that. So I'm going to show you that script. Simply use a command window, so do the, have the name of the script, and you specify the particular index of the connection exerciser that you want to operate. And so it started, and you can see it starts in high speed. The window pops up, now it's disconnected. Now it's connected as a super speed device. The window pops up, and now it disconnects. And now, as I said, it repeats. So this lets you do all kinds of testing that would be otherwise very hard to do uh, with manual cable insertions. Um, and the, the, uh, we find it to be extraordinarily useful both for testing software and for testing new hardware. Um, one thing to be aware of, the connection exerciser, although it does support uh, USB 3.0, it's also very good for testing USB 2 devices. So it, it can be used for both 3.0 and 2.0 devices. MCCI is a certified USB test lab. We went to the trouble of characterizing this channel. So the, 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 uh, the whole connection path between your device and your host will be just about as good as it would be with a real cable. So uh, you won't see any uh, artifacts of using the connection exerciser. So that's all I have to show you. Uh, it's available on our website. Thank you very much for your attention.